It's Morgan in Canada. Northern Canada. Hello, and welcome back to Ponery's Penny Arcade. This is Season 7, Episode 2 of The Long Dark. This is the Sandbox Survival, and I pick up where we left you last. We are at this here cave, which is here. I just marked it over here. And I did a quick study of the map I found on the interwebs, and I think I took the high road where I could have took the low road and probably ended up right at the gold mine, which is way up here. But I think when I saw this bridge, I walked us all the way around, and then we ended up climbing all these. So we're going to take the high road. Uh, supposedly we're going to run into a couple of encampments or cabins and things, so that's kind of encouraging. And being an irresponsible camper, I'm going to leave our fire yet again. So, thank you. You served me well. But, it is bright out. Bright enough, that is. So let's get going, shall we? I can tell you now, I'm not really a fan of this map. It's congested. There's a lot of stuff here, though. So that's a, that's a bonus. Maybe I could get to like it. Okay, there's that bridge. Let's take a look around here. Uh, what's this? It doesn't say anything. I guess it's just a guide path. Yarp. I think we're going to end up at that bridge somehow. Well, let's survey since we're here. And it's morning in Canada. There we go. Alright. There's a wolf out there somewhere. Right. Uh, ooh, rifle ammunition. Yes, please. Strange place to leave it. I'll take it. So this is the first episode of this series you've seen on my channel, then... We are in Ash Canyon, and this is Season 7. You may be a little confused at what's going on. I don't blame you. I would recommend you uh, go back to Season 1 and start from the beginning. There's a lot of procedural explanations on what's going on. And how, how, it's, how this is going on, and why this is going on. Get it a little bit brighter. Survey here. Mark the rose hips. Okay, so we're here now. Yeah, that's, that's got to go that way somehow. Hopefully. Uh, no. Yeah. So th yeah, this is the path. It's gonna take us to that bridge. It has to. There's nowhere else to go. Very linear map. Like there's a thing I can climb down, which I'm definitely going to want to do, because these don't cost any stamina, which is great. So it's like a free <laughs> elevation change, despite all his whining, crying, complaining, moaning, you name it. Just mark this when it gets to the bottom of this one. <laughs> there we go. More rose hips. I always find ro you always find rose hips at the base of these climbs. Uh, let's go ahead and mark this. Ooh, it didn't mark the climbs. Imagine that. Free wood. Another guide. Maybe I should mark these with the spray can. Go direction. The shape is not shown on the map when sprayed. Avoid direction. Well, let's just do searched. Here, we'll just... Yeah. There we go. Yeah. Fine. Is that a wolf's jaw overlook? That must be this. We ain't gonna overlook much with all this snow. Something down there. Let's go find it. 
This high road is uh, pretty sparse. Like, I haven't seen a lot of stuff. I haven't seen a single body on this map yet, either. Just animal carcasses, because I shot animals, but... Ooh. On your tippy toes. like a dead end. Who matches? I'm gonna dare. I dare. Let's just take a quick look back. Yeah, that's not scary at all. Let's do something even scarier. Let's survey while on the bridge. That's shaking. Okay, yeah, we're definitely on this. That's going to take us northeast. So, yeah, let's just keep going. I know I'm doing the jerky camera work again, sorry. I can't help it in this game. Like, I'm constantly, like, scanning for things. Okay, let's mark here. Oh, it just became low visibility. Fantastic. really like to mark this area too. I'm on, the, I'm on the warm side of this. Sleep for about two hours, get some rest, see if the storm passes by and clear up. Nope. Oh, and we're on the cold side of the storm now, too. Damn it. Alright, so go back over here. There we go. And put that down. Get an hour of sleep again. I'm not tired enough. Meh. Fine. Let's just pass time then. Still kind of blizzardy, isn't it? Yeah. So it's going to be dark by the time this is over. <laughs> or not. Maybe it won't be over at all. Oh no! I'm in the cold. Can't feel my feet. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Uh, let's see. It's going into it. We don't want to do that. We want to be here. Yeah. Let's grab a drink. Thermia. <laughs> Ooh, the storm stopped. Nice. And I can survey. Nice. There we go. Alright, so this is all filled in now. Well, that was unpleasant. And we're almost out of daylight. Again. Very, very linear map. Oh, this would have been the perfect place to shelter up, huh? Yep. I could 
a bit of fire there. Bedroll right on the right on the ground. That would have worked. So there's a dead body here somewhere. I can hear the crows. Oh, never mind. All right, <clears throat> another bridge. Survey this before it gets too dark. I didn't even check to see if there's matches on the ground. We're running out of daylight, so we can't really mess about. This one. It's getting dark. No signs of shelter anywhere. Yeah, so far not a fan of this map. <laughs> not a warm bed to sleep in. Really pretty out there, though, huh? Like I could, I could feel what that must look like, or I can see this, and I can feel what I'm looking at when you suck in that cold air on a really, really cold day. Yeah, do it slowly. You don't want to. You no, know, freezing your lungs sounds ridiculous, but you breathe in nice and slow, you won't cough a lot as your lungs start to freak out from how cold the air is. Ooh, what's that? Obviously, this is a rabbit cove. Let's see if I can map this before I run out of light. Yeah. Oh, I didn't mark it as a rabbit cove. Interesting. What do we have here? This looks like another wiped out... Oh, yeah, it's another fire. Sewing kit, a couple of broken arrows... Condensed the fish. A raw rainbow trout on a cloth. Wonder if this is any good to eat. Ruined. Yeah, I might be able to do something with that. Is that a bow? Yeah, free bow. Paint. Ketchup chips. Huh. Why would you have camped here? There's no exit. Huh. Strange place to set up camp. Onward! See, I marked all the branches already. It's super linear map. It's like there is no go left or right. This is just follow the tunnel, more or less. Another bridge. getting some headway up this way. There's supposed to be like a foreman's cabin and something else. Oh, great. Now I get to choose left or right. Um, I pick right. Shoot. Let's see. I'm going to mark this as a spot that I'm searching. So I'm going to go this way. And then if this ends up being bunk, I'll come back and put an X on top of it. Saying I searched it and it's crap. so far. Oh, Jesus Christ. Did I hit him? You know what? <laughs> I don't want to find out. Freaking bear on a mountain. Are you kidding me? 
I'm pretty sure I hit him. There he is. Yeah! Yeah! Wait, you, could you be could be faking it? There. Now you're not faking it. Now you're definitely dead. Frick. How dare you sneak up on me like that? Shitty bear. Wow. What are you doing up here? I'm just quartering his ass. It's dusk, so the night can't be far behind. Frostbite risk. I'm warming up. What the hell? Wait, did I ruin my gloves or something? Oh, yeah. Look at that. Here, I gotta put on something else. Let's put on fleece. There. Wow, I didn't even think about this. All right, let me wear these. My hat's frozen. All right, so we'll wear this. This is wet. These are my snow pants, right? No, these are my snow pants. These are deer skins. All right, so I'll wear that. And this should take care of our frostbite situation. Uh, there, get all the wet stuff off of us. Two point eight, three point one. I can leave that on. I can deal with that. Oh god, it's dark now. Quarter. Quarter. Guts. There's a bunch of guts. Okay. Freaking bear. How dare you. Oh, I left my cartridges on the floor, didn't I? I'm gonna be able to see them. Pretty sure I took a shot at him here. You know what? I don't need him that bad. What do we got here? Fur, good. Cedar. I wonder why they always by snow. do that. Nothing to drink. Oh, here. Always do that. You find one log, they give you one of both. He's pretty tired out. The night's still kind of early. Let's see what this is over here. Real quick. Oh, this was the bear cave, clearly. Right, okay. Uh, since we conquered him, and I can't see squat, let's go ahead and just camp here for the night. Yeah, it seems legit. If you're wondering why I'm going through the cardboard matches first, it's just because I want to get rid of them. The wood matches are better. But I just want to get rid of these. Come on. Anytime you see the bones in the cave, I've probably mentioned this in several seasons now, but All right. if you ever see these bones in a cave, then you're obviously in a place where a bear spawns or is nearby if you haven't killed one in the area. skin rug roll thing I wonder if I can cure the skin that I just took oh I already have one well hell in that case um, that needs repair and my bear skin bed rug needs repair Well, I spend more time in this coat, so let's go ahead and fix the coat first. That's, that makes sense to me. There we go. And I think we got a warmth bonus. 
Yeah, almost a full degree. That's good. But now I don't have a cured bear hide anymore. I have to make one, right? I have a cured moose hide. That's kind of nice. Fresh, fresh. I knew it. Okay, so let's drop. Just to see if it'll cure a little. I doubt it will, but whatever. It's worth a shot. Eat. Let's go ahead and harvest this. Try to make best use of my time. Looks like it's getting windy. Hopefully that doesn't affect us. And then what I'll do is I'll maximize this. I'll, uh... Oh yeah, I gotta try to cook this. Let's try that first. And we'll go ahead and make up some water while we're waiting. So it's past 20 minutes. And here's the cool thing. Now the trout is 50%, even though it was ruined at zero before. So I'm gonna eat that. Mm -mm. Okay, let's go ahead and cook up some bear meat. Hopefully this won't affect my, uh, my fire. Okay, let's cook this. 46 and 45. So this is how you maximize your time. You set up the food, you take an hour nap. You set up the food, you take up an hour nap. Which, realistically speaking, how do you do that if you don't have any way of waking yourself up? Like, if you're bushed and exhausted, how's that going to work? Not supposed to know. Maybe it's the smell, right? It's like... Ooh, that smells delish. Okay, let's go for that, you know? Okay, let's drink some water. And then I can sleep the rest of the evening. So let's say six hours? That sounds good. It should definitely give me daylight by then. this up. That wasn't going to cure. Figures. Take this. And let's cook up a uh, coffee. Let's heat up the coffee real quick. You know, get your day started right. our warmth bonus then just top it off with cold water I don't know why but whatever doing it slightly backwards you know the deal alright and let's be irresponsible campers and leave the fire behind that'll scare the bear off like yeah you remember this next time I come back is that more bones yeah see this is more bear warning these both go the same way. Uh, yeah. Sure. Yeah, they both go the same way. Alright. Oh, I should have probably surveyed this slightly. Yeah. Actually, you know what? Now that I think about it, let me go back over here real quick. I have an idea. Uh, and apparently my gear, after I made the changes, gave me a little bit more running room. Ooh, what's this? Skull. 
Right. Okay, let's paint this as danger. Hopefully this shows up on the map. Yeah, cool. Now we know where the bear cave is. <laughs> nice. Okay. Let's get our gear back to what we actually want to wear, which would be two, six, three, four. What? Can I repair this? Yeah. Because the rabbit skin hat's supposed to be better, warmth wise. So, three, six. Three, four, yeah. Put that back on. Uh, let's put our rabbit skin gloves back on. Yep. And I think my other, my deerskin pants. Ooh, I need to fix that too. I think I got a deer hide on me. Man, it's wasting so much of the day. All right. Oh, these aren't as good. But they give you better resistances. Uh, that's why I put them on. It's not for the warmth, it's for the resistance. Alright. Get my ski boots back on. I really need to fix those too. But we ain't got time for that, because we ran through so much of the day just checking out our material. Hmm. We have to find a shelter. I can really sit down and do the maintenance. What did this used to be? What cabin did this used to be? Let's see if it marks it or not. I think I see another building off to the distance, too. Nothing. Yes, there it is. Okay. Hey, look, civilization. Finally. Something resembling civilization, rather. this reminds me of? This looks like that little town. Miner's Folly. This looks like the little town that you see in the beginning of Red Dead Redemption 2. After the getaway. Maybe I can get a screenshot and I'll put that in there for you. Some reclaimed wood. Really? Fuel cans? No, I can't even... I, there's, you can't even get anything out of the fuel cans? For real? What have we here? Hey, a stem. Nice. Is that leather? Hello. Scrap metal. Workbench. Alright, let's take a look. I don't need to build anything. That's all this is for. Yeah. Can I get... There's no drawer. Damn. There's a cooking stove. That's good to know. Ooh, it's... Hey, bro. You all right? Hey. What's going on, bud? Got anything good for me? Hope I can still eat this. It, it, is it really jerky, or is it just his flesh? Because it's kind of the same thing at this point, if you look at him. Sorry, bro. All right. This looks like a coal thing. Supply bin. What you got? Spray paint. I should probably mark this area once I'm done. There's a cabin! There's a cabin! Alright. We have found no life but new civilizations. Alright. Is that a reclaimed hiding in there? Yeah. Who's a backpack? Hello. This will come in handy. A lot of spray paint out here. I'll take a quick peek over the top. Right quick. Um, I don't see nothing. What are those? Hmm. Are 
trees. Uh, just more of those little plants. Okay. All my gear's so heavy, so I, I gas out. I can barely run. That's why that bear was so dangerous, because I can't run very far with this gear that I'm wearing. Alright. We found a bed. Nice. Okay, let's take a look in here. Nothing. Let's read it. It's gold, all right. Can't believe how much. Jesse wants to go even deeper, but we're all waiting on the foreman to give us a thumbs up. The vein we opened looks like it go on and on. Just have to be careful how we... Looks like he never finished it. Alright, so I can break all this down for wood. Uh, break that down for tinder. Candy bar. Can opener. Dog food. Condensed milk. Condensed milk is good because I don't think it ever goes bad. Soda. Nothing else. Book. Newsprint. Antibiotics. More spray paint. Ooh, a locker. This stuff will come in handy. Eh. Material. Ooh, what's this? Work pants. Right. And another chair. Ooh, there's stuff up on the shelf. Accelerant book book. Sweet, that's a nice little windfall. Anyway, we're out of time for the day. This was the next 30 of The Long Dark Survival Sandbox Season 7, Episode 2. Boy, that's a mouthful. Anyway, if you like what you see and you'd like to get a copy of this game for yourself, which has been around for quite a while, I'll leave you a link in the description below. If you're new to my channel, welcome. But if you're a regular here, welcome back. Either way, maybe check out my other playlist and see if my other interest might be of interest to you. What I'm going to do next is tear down this cabin of everything I can get materials for. And so when I meet you next, this place will be a lot cleaner. And we will be fully rested because I'll probably have to sleep off the night. And we will continue exploring Ash Canyon. So until then, we'll see you later.